Uh, this is Freddie Williams, and I've had um, a few people email and ask me how to make a double page spread out of a master page template that they've either created themselves or uh, that they've downloaded off of my website, freddyart.com, in the uh, uh, DigiArt Quick Tool section. So I figured I'd make a quick tutorial instead of emailing. So um, let's see, first you'd want to go, uh, you'd want to open up your, your master page template here. I just have the standard one. And um, uh, we're going to create a duplicate file, which is just going to be temporary. So just go to Image, Duplicate, and let's call this, um, instead of copy here at the end, let's just call this Temp, so we know for sure that this is going to be a temporary file. So we hit OK. And as you can see, even in the Layers palette, they're both built the same way. This is a temporary file that has not been saved on your hard drive or anything. It's just literally a duplicate of the first file. So. Uh, if you go to the template of the first file and rename that layer group um, L template for left template and then rename uh, go to the copy file uh, let's rename that template layer group R template this will make sense in just a second then go back to the um, uh, your original source file if you can't see them already go to view show guides or you can just hit Command colon or Control colon whatever, so you can see all these um, uh, you can see all these guides here. So if you zoom in on the right hand side at the bottom, you can see here that this says there's there's actually instructions in the document that says cut left hand page at this line. This is for a double page spread. Um, so you can just use your crop tool and crop right at that line. Let's zoom in and make sure we're at the right line here, which we are. Let's hit enter. So it's cropped the page off at this uh, the crop line. So now we've just handled the, the left-hand side of the spread. Now let's do the same thing on the right. So we're going to crop all the way. Let's see, I think it's right here. And then let's zoom in to be sure. Yep, cut at right-hand side for the, uh, for the right-hand side of the page. So now we've got um, you know the left hand side over here and then the right hand side over here. So how do we get them in the same document? Let's go to the parent one. Um, let's go to image canvas size. I'm going to um, uh, push this to the left, this left hand side, uh, left hand button option, and then the height is fine, but uh, the width needs to be a uh, uh, double. So uh, right now we're at 10.5 inches. That means we need to go to 21 inches hit OK and now we can see that the left hand page is still here but then we have all this extra dead space on the side so, so I'm gonna shrink this down so you can see what I'm doing here um, so on the left hand side here is still the um, the parent file as I'm calling it and then over here is the right hand side just grab a hold of this right hand template drag it into that document Okay, so let's click this into place. It should kind of like click into the, the edge of your document bounds. And then I'll zoom in. So now we have, this is a double page spread. And we have, as you can see, the, the, the template matches up here in the center. Now we just need to finish off the guides, clean those up a little bit for the double page spread instead of a single page. Click your move tool. As you can see, whenever I move my uh, cursor over the top of um, one of these guides, it, it changes the shape of it, so you can like move around your the guide. So I just move that one. That guide is accurate now. I'm going to drag another guide here, and drag another guide here, and the last guide here in the live area. So here you go. Here's your uh, double page spread. So now you have the right hand side, the left hand side. It's kind of up to you on how you want to organize these two together. Um, uh, you can select them both and group them together and just call the parent um, template. So now you have a layer group that has the left and right hand side in it. It's it's up to you. If you want to go in and do some selective merging so they're on the same layer so that all of the, the blue lines or something are all on the same layer, that's entirely your prerogative. Now at the end here, um, you won't need this uh, the, the duplicate file that's marked temp. You can just close it uh, and don't save. 
it's okay to get rid of that. And this other one here, you don't want to save over your other master page template. So uh, you want to go to File, Save As, and then save it out as, you know, DPS or Double Page Spread, something like that. So that concludes how to make a double page spread master page template out of a single page master page template. I hope that helps. Please feel free to check out my website, freddyart.com, for other tutorials and DigiArt Quick Tool downloads. Thank you.